Hello everybody, it's the Game Legend here, and today we're gonna be playing the new Brawlhalla update for the fifth anniversary. It looks absolutely insane already. Um, I did play a little bit earlier, uh, just so I could buy some stuff, some colors for, you know, my mains, or just for all the Hammer Legends that I could get. Um, but yeah, here's the title screen, looks pretty sick. We got some, we got all the original characters up top. We got Bodvar chilling in the middle. We got some, we got one skin. We got this Bodvar skin, looking pretty clean. Uh, we got this podium glided deco, deco, which however way you say it, also looking nice. Emotes, we have uh, birthday cake one, looking pretty nice. And then finally, just the colors. Look at these colors, looking pretty good. Um, I have it for every Hammer Legend except Thor, Taros, and I believe Core. So anyway. We're going to be getting into experimentals and showing off the new colors as well as the new effects. I already clicked it. I don't know why it's not loading. <laughs> loading times have been very slow recently. Maybe we'll get in. Maybe not. Okay. What's happening? <laughs> um, okay, there we go. <laughs> but let's get into game one with Cassidy. Also, completely forgot to mention this earlier, um, they didn't add titles, which is a completely new reward. Um, they don't say how they're gonna give them out exclusively. Could get in the car with this guy. Let's go. <laughs> but they didn't actually say how they're gonna get, give them out. I know there's gonna be one for viewership rewards. There's one for every year you've played. And there's one for um, just playing during the anniversary event which is Re Rever Revelor or something like that but yeah uh, it's pretty cool pretty cool Ooh, oh dang I was trying to go for something cool there but yeah uh, titles are pretty cool they aren't super crazy but I do think they're a nice little thing to add just kind of a little flex on other people <laughs> like if you have it and other people don't just kind of cool this person has uh, the third year version i only have the second year uh, i'm currently in my second year going to the third next year i thought i've been playing for longer but i guess not but here we go getting first stock off eight loving these colors already everyone's using them because you know they're completely new like they're brand new uh not even like just re returning they're completely new and it's sick honestly it's been a while i think since we've had a new event maybe not um i don't know <laughs> I don't remember a new event since I've been playing. I know there's been, I think back to school was the last event that they added new. Maybe not though, maybe I'm wrong. But either way, here we go. Oh God. <laughs> I just got side sick into oblivion. Also, I don't know if you've noticed yet, but I've been, or you've actually probably watched a ton of other videos before you've seen this one. But anyway, the new effects are looking really good. Maybe if I can hit a side stick, I can show them off. I can show off the smoke trail effect. They made the wall touch more visible. They made dodge a little more clean and gravity cancel got a complete rework. There's the smoke trail. Um, here's the gravity cancel. It makes like a little platform below you, which apparently is the Bifrost, which is obviously like a um, mythology thing for the gods or whatever. I don't know exactly which one, I think Norse? Mythology, if I'm wrong, I know I think that's where uh, Valhalla's from. I don't know, but <laughs> something right on there. It's in the lore. I know there's a lot of people who read the lore. I'm not super deep into it, but it's, it's interesting when you have to when you have to read it. Ooh, nice little uh, weapon throw to keep me alive. There we go. Getting one, st uh, getting another stock off. Really liking the weapon skin, by the way. I think the gold, like the rose gold kind of color on it, looks pretty good. Pretty good. I think these colors are really clean. Probably some of the best colors in the game. Even though um, it doesn't work super well with my characters. I think it works best with Bovar, who I'm going to be playing next. Which actually is Xavier Woods. Because it's, it's just kind of it's kind of cool looking. <laughs> um, I think basic, but also like good colors work well with that character. Also, it, his like sword and hammer are gold, which looks pretty cool. I do really like... Uh, Xavier Woods' hammer skin looks good on basically every character in the game. But yeah, this is a really sick update, honestly. <laughs> like, definitely, like, 
9 or 10 out of 10. Like, it's really high up there. Or at least in my opinion. I know a lot of people aren't super happy because, um... There was no balance changes, but... They obviously can't do that right now. <laughs> With a huge tournament happening right now. So, I think they will be, um... They will be doing a balance change, like, right after BCX. So, that hopefully, that'll be a good one. Get all the balancing done right then and there. I think BCX is probably one of the best places or best times to have balance changes. Like, right after, because you know which things are dominant right now, which is pretty cool. But yeah, there we go. That's a good little game one. Beating the Fate player. Getting some battle points, even though I don't really need them. But, yeah, let's get into game two with Xavier Woods. Here's some of the skins I have. Uh, with the color schemes, I'm actually going to stick with all these things. All of them look amazing. But yeah, let's get into game two. Hopping into game two. Here we go. Against the Nyx, who is also a uh, two-year player. I haven't been noticing a lot of those. There are a lot of uh, two-year players. Which I guess is the majority, apparently. Um, I know Charles is a two-year. Uh, if you're new, you don't know who he is. <laughs> uh, unless you've been watching a ton of streams, because he's in like almost all my streams because I like to do streams with other people because uh, it's kind of hard for me to just keep talking especially when I'm alone but I, I can manage it for like a 10-12 minute video but <laughs> for like a th two or hour and two hour stream kind of difficult not gonna lie also um, if anyone's even watching right now apparently my watch time is not amazing but <laughs> um, I just registered for Community color giveaways, which hopefully I get approved. It's not confirmed yet, but if I do, that'll be sick. Because I, I like to give some stuff back. I already have community colors, so it won't directly benefit me. But I think it's nice to give back, uh, especially since, you know, um, BMG is just kind of giving them to people. Just kind of make, make things a lot better. <laughs> just kind of giving away free stuff just because it, it's kind of cool. I do think... Uh, BMG is a really good uh, content creator slash like partner program so really cool to see that you know I'm eligible because I checked all the requirements so hopefully I'll make it but they might have their own reasons not to which is not a problem at all but anyways we're catching up with this Nyx um, doing pretty good wearing the Battle Pass 2 uh, skin, which is pretty sick. Just got that one. Just made a video on it yesterday. Uh, it's it's a really cool skin, honestly. Uh, if I'm ever playing Nyx, definitely using that one. Because basically, just because I don't have any Nyx skins. <laughs> but even without that, I think it's probably one of the one of the better ones. I think all the Battle Pass skins so far have been sick. Just they're all just really nice, really clean, really uh, just good to use for everything honestly especially a tier 100 tier 100s are perfect so far i think it's nice that they're kind of like crossovers with like the effects uh and all the weapons are animated it's pretty cool huge fan of most of the weapon skins or actually all of the weapon skins if i'm ever playing spear i'm usually using the hatori skin or uh heat wave because you know i got heat wave <laughs> for the cassidy blasters so I, I just like that one too, but usually I use the Hattori one just because I kind of like it a little more, but it's pretty good. But yeah, uh, <laughs> back to the update. Uh, I kind of get off track sometimes, but anyways, uh, my favorite part about it's probably the new effects, honestly. They're really cool. The new event is insane, obviously. It's definitely one of my favorite events so far. Really like the Bodvar skin, and most of the uh, like original legends are Hammer. And obviously I love Hammer, so hopefully when it comes back, they will be having some uh, some even more Hammer love. Whereas, yeah, see, we got Cassidy and Bodvar. Those are my two mains. We got Nash, who is, I also play a lot. Here's just proof that I, I main Cassidy. I have, like, every skin for Cassidy. I have a bunch for Bodvar and Nash. Nash, not so much. I just started playing Nash, but... Anyway, speaking of Nash, uh, let's play him for Game 3. Uh, let me switch on to my favorite Hammer. And we'll do that. We'll do that one. And yeah, let's get into game three. Last game of the video. Getting into game three against the Hattori. Uh, I didn't actually see what her or what their what's it called title was. So <laughs> that kind of sucks. But anyway, let's just see how we can do. I'm not a 
huge spear player. Actually, I don't really play it too much at all. Um, but we can see what we can do here. I wouldn't say my spear is terrible because I obviously have better or I have worse weapons, but definitely not one of my top weapons at all. So let's see what we can do here. Okay. Hits me with a nice little recovery. Let's see if we can catch him with hammer because that's my favorite weapon. Best weapon in the game. Just kidding. That's obviously a great sword. <laughs> you can just take like one look at tournament. It's definitely a great sword. Uh, Jayun in tournaments because obviously Mako isn't legal yet. Uh, so we can't really use her. But here we go. Ooh, catching him with the recovery into the down throw. That's like my favorite combo with hammer. <laughs> it's not even a combo. It's nowhere near true, but it hits so much, especially in um, unranked. Hits a surprising amount of time in rank too, but only a couple times. Maybe like two times max, and then it's just people dodge through it. But anyway, let's see. I'm going to expect a sig. Yep. We can catch it. D sig, catching him off guard. And weapon throw to finish. There we go. Ooh, I was sweating. He's sweating. I love that effect. That's probably my favorite effect. Me and Charles already made so many jokes about the he's sweating. <laughs> Because that, uh, that was one of the quotes I think Foda said in the dev stream, <laughs> revealing it. And I thought it was funny, so I, I just keep saying it. But here we go. Maybe we can get a cheese. I love how the platform moves with you. I think that's a really good touch. Because, you know, it just kind of makes sense. If it didn't, there would be no point in the platform. But here we go. Hattori is on sword. So I should be able to space him out pretty good with spear. Ooh. Gets squeezes through. <laughs> Had some trouble talking there. But here we go. Let's go with side sig, jump over the weapon throw. His spear is definitely better than mine. So it's going to be a bit difficult. Oh, that's not the sig I wanted. Oh, did not know that would catch me. Surprising. And no, D sig didn't know that. I should probably test more matchups with spear because I had no clue that that wouldn't go through. But anyway. I should probably start playing Nash more. Honestly, he's a really good character and really fun. Probably, I think he has the best stats in the game. Whew, there we go. Hitting a nice D-Sig. Oh, he doesn't even have a title equipped. But anyway, uh, that's going to be pretty much for, for the video. <laughs> um, but before we leave, I'm just going to show off my titles. I got three. None, Reveler, and Veteran of Asgard. Uh, basically, what I think about the event is it's sick. Love everything about it. Love new test features and everything's looking good. But yeah, this can be pretty much it for the video. Hope you guys enjoyed. Um, we're doing a Q&A at 300 subs if we hit it by the end of the year. And we have Discord in the description. That's where you can leave all the questions. But yeah, um, peace out.